Hey guys, Luke from TechGeek.biz and today we're going to have a batch script starting off a PowerShell script. So this one's going to be only about, what's that, four lines of code. I'm going to leave this link that's in the description. So just follow that link and copy these lines out if you want to do the exact same. So you're going to paste this in. Basically, these variables um, do tell you this is a script directory. That's just a variable. Or the current working directory um, and the PowerShell script path as well so that's that plus the name of the PowerShell script in the folder you have so for instance um, to make it easy you can just name your script main.ps1 and that will make it a lot easier um, and then this is the actual PowerShell that it runs to kick it off um, it bypasses um, the execution policy it starts a PowerShell process and then it opens the actual file itself. And yeah, and it runs as admin as well, which is quite a handy one. So yeah, very easy. So what you also need to do is you need to go to file savers and just save this as whatever you want to call dot bat. I've saved it as run dot bat to make it easy. And yeah, job done. And then it'll work like a treat for any script you want to start up. Can be handy for scheduled tasks and so on as well. Alright, thanks guys. So, comment, like, and subscribe as usual. But yeah, or if you have any more ideas, that'd be great. Thanks guys. See ya.